Mm -hmm. Totally. Yeah. Stiffness yes. can lead to that. Yes. But if you're going through it and you have good range of motion and you, st and you, you still, still feel have pain, right. then that's when you have to seek. That's so when you have yeah. to seek. Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Coach Caesar. I'm here with Dr. Catherine Kano on today's episode of Function and Fitness. And today we're going to be talking about shoulder injuries and why they suck. Now, we both have shoulder injuries, and I didn't seek a physical therapist until I came across Dr. Kano. Um, and she just blew my mind with different things that I wasn't paying attention to with my training. Um, so, she's going to get into it. She's going to share with you guys some tips and possible self-checks that you can do, not diagnosis, self-checks. Um, she'll get into that stuff. Alrighty. So there are four major reasons why we develop shoulder injuries. Uh, number one is arthritis. Number two is an actual fracture. You fall and land on your shoulder. You break something in that, in that upper region. Three is a tendinopathy uh, or bursitis, an overuse injury. And four is a shoulder instability, which is very common. Um, you know, we have that one friend that's able to pop out their shoulder. You know, that's something you shouldn't do. So easy ways to, to see if you have shoulder pain uh, or shoulder injuries is pain, number one. Two, um, poor posture. So you can go back to our first video on, on the importance of posture. And, um, and three is limited active range of motion and, you know, and strength. So a good way to start uh, a check is See if you have active range of motion. So we'll have Caesar demonstrate. So full shoulder flexion extension. You know, good. He has it, but you see his pain face. So there may be something going on. Okay. External rotation check is have hands behind your head. We'll have him turn around. See how far if they're pretty even. Okay. He's got good range of motion, but still some of that pain face going on. And the third one is um, internal rotation. So reaching your hands behind your back. So for women, if you're unable to unstrap your bra, it's probably because you have an underlying shoulder injury. So here Caesar's pretty good, but he still has the pain face. I'm gonna show you my injury so you can see the difference. Okay, here, I have my fingertips touching. Now look at this, left shoulder turn rotation. Okay, I have problems in my left shoulder. There's tons of underlying issues that can be going on, it could be, um, you know, neck related, it could be rib mobility, it could be, you know, your scapulas, your shoulder blades aren't moving. So these are, these are issues that you need to speak to your coach, your trainer on, on how to avoid injury, make sure your, your proper form when you're executing your exercises, and, and then seek a physical therapist, a healthcare professional to really evaluate you, see what's going on so you don't cause any further damage in there. So anything else to add, Caesar, to that? Um, that's about it. Just pay attention to those shoulders. Um, it's very common. I, I see it all the time. Um, I've experienced it. This is probably the third time, either from martial arts or from uh, weight training. And um, it's something that you want to pay attention to. Don't just try and do it on your own. Seek a medical professional, just like you said. Or if you're working with a trainer, coach, tell them to as well. Um, super important. Uh, that's about it. Function and fitness. Doc, uh, <laughs> Coach Caesar and Dr. Kano. I'm a doctor. Yes. <laughs> uh, we'll see you guys soon.